Right, Lou, uh, I'd like to try something else now. Um, it's not quite a card trick uh, in, the, in the true sense of the word. It's more of a sort of experiment, uh, sort of game okay. of sorts. And um, I think I'll win the game because I'm going to base the way I play the game on some answers that you give me to some questions that I'm going to ask you. Okay, and based on the way you answer, I'm going to play uh, the game and hopefully the outcome will be in my favour. Okay. Um, so it's important that you don't think too much about it, um, but you just answer the questions off the top of your head. And they're simple questions, all right? Uh -huh. Here's the first one. If, you were to, if I was to ask you to name a three-digit number, what would you say? 150. 150, okay. That's quite a roundish sort of number there. Um, okay, that, that's fine. Um, if I was to ask you to picture there's a car driving down the street, okay? Now quickly, what colour is it? Blue. Okay, okay. Um, it's a pretty, pretty standard answer, so you're quite a rounded person, it would, it would seem. Um, let's go for the last one. If I was to ask you for a short man's name, and that's a short man's name, not a short man like <laughs> Danny DeVito or Napoleon, um, but a short man's name. Matt. Perfect. Is that double T? Or? Yeah. It is, is it? Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, um, based on sort of the answers you've given, I, I think uh, I know how this is going to turn out. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to write down a little prediction, okay? And I won't show it to you until the end, okay? okay? I'll just write it here on one of the cards that we're, uh, that we're not going to use. I don't want you to see what I write. It's very much a secret. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, um... Okay, I think that um, should just about do it. Like I say, I don't want you to see what I've written. I'm going to just uh, place it under under here uh, for now. All right, okay. I'll leave that there. Now, um, now we sort of play the game. Um, I'm going to remove some cards. Man, I don't want you to see what they are, but there's one in particular that I think you may end up with, depending on how this how this goes. And um, it's important that I know where one of them is in particular. So I'm going to put it there. I'm going to lay them out like this, OK? OK. Now, here's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to just point to any two cards. Mm -hmm. And either of the two that I point at, you can eliminate one. You follow? OK. So I'll, I'll point at these two. Which one do you want to eliminate? That one. That one. Yeah, it's closest to you, but that's all right. Mm -hmm. um, and now um, you can point to two. Okay, and I'll eliminate this one, okay? And I'll point at these two. Okay, you want to get rid of that one. Uh, there's only two left, so just uh, just point at one. Okay? And um, this is the one we ended up on. Now, this is um, quite interesting. I think it's interesting anyway. But what you've ended up with is the three of diamonds. I've put that right in the middle. Um, if, if you were to watch this tape back, you will see that it actually started it right in the middle. Okay. And the reason I put it there is because 150 is quite a solid number. The colour blue, and it, Matt was a bit uh, different, but um, the, the double T on the end had, had, had a certain, uh, you know, a definite end to it anyway. And I thought if I put it in the middle, that's probably what we would end up with, and you did. Because okay. in actual fact, I wrote on the, uh, the two of clubs, my little message was, three of diamonds you see so I sort of uh, <laughs> predicted you would end up there which is which is pretty good um which is which is good you know um and you know I obviously uh wrote that there like that now here, here's what's actually interesting is that you've seen another couple of tricks today and um you know while while you may be thinking that perhaps you thought of these answers off the top of your head would you be surprised if I sort of said I knew what your answers would be before you yeah yeah I, I did actually hope that it would go this way because um, I put a prediction um, in between these two jokers, all right? Mm -hmm. What I've done is I stuck a post-it note to the back of this one here. Yeah. Uh, it's been in the card case there. Now, uh, just down here is what I thought you might answer. You'll notice that I wrote um, 150, <laughs> uh, the colour blue, and Matt with two T's, no less. That's so weird. I know.